Welcome to Devices Setup and today we will learn how to set up Asus RP-AX58 AX3000 dual band Wi-Fi extender. So there are three ways to set up this particular extender. First is via app, second is via WPS and third is via browser. Moreover, you can follow this guide to set up any Asus Wi-Fi extender too. The setup steps are same for all models except some older models does not support the app setup. Anyways, to start with the setup, first make sure your Asus RP-AX58 extender is plugged in into a power source and currently have solid blue LED. Just in case, if it doesn't, then reset the extender once. Watch video given in the description to learn how to do it. Now we are going to download the Asus Extender app. You can find the app download link for both iOS and Android given in the description. So launch the app and tap on Setup Extender option followed by selecting the place where you would be keeping this extender. Next, select the network name that you want to extend and type its password for verification. Next, you will simply need to create an admin password that you will need once you try logging in into your Asus extender. After this, your extender will reboot and then you will be able to see your newly set up Asus extender network SSID showing up in your Wi-Fi list. Just in case, if this setup method is not working for you, then kindly make sure your phone is connected to the Asus extender network and then try the setup again via app moreover you can also reset it once and then try the setup again watch video given in the description to learn how to do it anyways now let's check the second method to set it up that is via browser for this too make sure your extender is plugged in into a power source next grab your phone or computer and go to its wi-fi list there you will find your extender network name showing up. You can find the default network name of your extender printed on the label of the extender. So connect to Asus Extender SSID. Once connected, open a browser on the same device and into the URL or address bar type asusrouter.com or 192.168.1.1 and hit enter. This will take you to the setup page of the extender. If it doesn't, then try repeater.asus.com and then follow the on screen instructions and then select the network name that you want to extend and type its password for verification. Once you click on save settings on the extender, it will then reboot, after which you will be able to see its SSID showing up in the Wi Fi list with underscore rpt suffix in the end of your home network ssid you can tap on this ssid to connect to it and type the same password as your home router's password moreover after setup you can unplug the extender and place it halfway between your router and the location where you have poor wi-fi connectivity also you won't have to set up the extender each time you unplug it now let's check the last method to set up asus extender for this plug the extender into a power source after two minutes press the wps button on the router and within two minutes press the wps button present on the extender on successful setup you will be able to see new ssid in your wi-fi list it will come up with underscore rpt suffix and password will be same as your router's password just in case if WPS setup method is not working, then it could be possible that the WPS is disabled on the router. You can watch video given in the description to learn how to enable it. Moreover, if you would like to log in into your extender after it is set up, then there are different instructions for that. You can watch video given in the description to learn about that too. Lastly, if you found this video useful, then please do hit like and subscribe to support my efforts. Thank you so much.